okay um okay so there has been slight change in the configuration which i have uh, like the network setup so i'm no longer going to record from 1.2 rather i'm going to record it right right off the machine where i am trying to uh, show you the uh, virtual globe from that is from this particular machine okay but other things are remaining the same so let me minimize the network diagram and um, this is where we are left at the last chapter so now let's go ahead and start uh, commenting out this particular piece of code so it's commented now let's copy and paste exercise number 3 control c go there paste it all right uncomment the multi line commenter wonderful super so uh, here what we are going to do is we are going to uh, have a similar setup like what we saw in exercise 2 uh, it's going to be the same up to here okay we are going to uh, learn about superimposing layers over here so what we are doing is we are calling something called as um, imagery layers uh, which is inside scene of a viewer then um, uh, assigning to a variable called layer okay then uh, since we have already applied this argis uh, layer on top of our globe which is shown here okay we are going to apply one more layer on top of this since we added one more layer this blue color globe would disappear okay what we are trying to get here is a black color globe which is called as a black marble and the source of it is present here okay and uh, we want to have a, a maximum level of zoom uh, that's what i suppose this is then the credit is uh, to nasa earth observatory okay let so let me have it saved okay since i have saved it i'm going to go over there and click on refresh so so uh, as you can see now this is a, a globe uh, which is called as a black marble so this is uh, basically the dark side of the globe uh, where you can see the lightings uh, lit up so if there is a lot of civilization you tend to see a lot of lightings up in the night wonderful see the Nile Valley okay wonderful let's proceed um, so what we are going to do uh, further to this is since that globe is uh, sort of uh, bit uh, like the, the, the reload oh oops okay so what we are going to do is we are going to okay there is one more thing called as layer dot lower uh, which for some reason did not work for me what the sh notes said on the ccmjs.org website is that the black color layer would get applied only to the lower southern hemisphere of the globe but that did not work for some reason for me uh, probably i did not uh, code it correctly so let's see about the alpha which is the transparency layer for the layer which we currently added so i'm giving it a transparency layer of 0.5 let's go there and refresh it we'll start seeing the blue color globe popping out popping out in the sense it will merge through so that you can see the blue color globe as well as the uh, lightings which were provided by the uh, black marble okay there is one more thing called as brightness and uh, any value greater than one would increase the brightness control s go back there refresh it there you have it this globe is a bit brighter than the globe which we already had previously all right so that Conclu concludes the uh, recording for this particular section uh, see you uh, in another video bye bye